We're here now at the EA Sports FC 24 launch. The Irish legend, upcoming legend, upcoming legend, and Brentford, Nathan Collins. How are you feeling, bro? I'm good, man. Not too bad yourself. I'm all good. I'm all good. You ex enjoying the night, are you? Yeah, it's good. Very good. All right, bro. Talk to me. EA FC has arrived. Yeah. How excited are you for that? I actually, it was sort of something like this bringing me in, like it's class because, you know, growing up and all playing it, you know, with all your mates and stuff like that now. So I'm buzzing for that. Yeah, I know. I heard you come from like a really competitive background. Yeah. All your uncles, all your your granddads, your dads, all you play football. So what's that like? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Basically, it's competition every, every time we see each other. Um, my brother's here now, even played a game of FIFA upstairs. I got a bit heated as well, like, you know what I mean? <laughs> who won? Who won? It was nil all, luckily. It was, <laughs> we're not great, but it got heated. Uh, no, it was good crack, but uh, even my little brother coming up now, he's going to get competitive with me, so it's just normal. Right. It's normal in the family. <laughs> all right, so talk to me. Obviously, you guys at Brentford, probably a lot of competitiveness. Who's the most competitive in the team when it comes to actual on the pitch, but also when it comes to gameplay? I'm probably up there, I'd say. Yeah, I don't <laughs> like losing. I can't stand it. I've never been able to deal with it. Like, oh. So I think I'm up there. Um, uh, Chris Iyer. Yeah, very, very emotional when he loses. Yeah, he lets it go, doesn't doesn't hold back. Uh, yeah, I'd say that's the two for now. But yeah, I, I don't like losing at all. <laughs> that. All right, and speaking about it, EAFC. Obviously, you played it before. Have you seen your card? Yeah, unfortunately, I have seen my card. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of it? It's, nah, it's not what I expected. I deserve more, I think. All right, let's go through your ratings. You talk to me about what you feel about it, right? You're 76 overall. Yes. Should be higher. <laughs> what do you think it should be? High 70s, a bit higher. 78, 79. And then push next year for the 80s. Yeah, me get that gold. Yeah. Gold. Yeah. yeah, of course. All right, do you know what your physical is? Uh, it was 76 or something like that. Oh, all right. So you've been watching it. You've been studying it. You've been studying it. Do you know what your pace is? Yeah, they done me dirty on that. It was, um, 67, was it? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm not happy with that. I'm not at all. What do you think it would be? High 70s. High 70s. Okay. You know, all right. All did right. dirty there. Yeah, you know. Listen to him. He wants high 70s. Give him the high 70s. <laughs> all right. Shooting. Yeah, this is uh, it's low as anything. It's 30s, isn't it? Yeah. Disrespectful, even like <laughs> bit disrespectful. I can't lie. All right. Now, what about passing? Uh, it was 50 ish, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Around there. Yeah, that should be higher again. It's 55. Uh, yeah, I, I like my pass. I think I'm a decent passer sometimes, so I feel like that should be a bit higher. Bit. Dribbling. You know, you like playing it out. Yeah, I think they've done me dirty as well on that, haven't they? They haven't seen my goal, have they? You know? <laughs> I don't think they've been watching you. I don't think they've been watching you over the last few years, bro. <laughs> no, let's go. Maybe 62 on Yeah, that. room to improve. That's the main thing. Room to improve. Mm. So, are you happy with overall or? Not really, no. <laughs> <laughs> now, obviously, bro, we need to switch it back to your olden days. Yeah, let's do it. You left Ireland when you were 15, was it? Yeah, young, 15, yeah. You were playing for Cherry Orchard? Yeah, I played for Cherry Orchard since I was a kid. From God knows when I was up there in uh, Valley Firm, I'll be training, yeah. Jesus, I used to be a Cherry Orchard by myself yeah. as well, yeah. We wasted the ball in there. What? What age were you? Oh, jeez, I'm 23 now. Yeah, I see only a couple over me, yeah. Not far enough, not far enough. <laughs> you were probably the guy that was balling in the back Obviously, yeah, you went from Cherry Orchard all out to London and that's not something that most people do these days no no like, a lot of people go from like like if you were a few years younger would you think you would have went into League of Ireland as opposed to coming in into England now yeah looking at it, that's that's looking like the pathway isn't it you know or you can go up, to, up north can't you go Scotland way or, or abroad uh, even foreign like Italy and stuff like that but no, I think what they're creating now in the League of Ireland is good for up-and-coming players. You know, I think what they're doing there, they're really treating it better, you know, investing a lot into it and putting a lot of time and effort into players, which is the main thing. So I think either way, you go away again or abroad, further away, or stay in Dublin or Ireland, wherever, I think I think it's good for either way. Yeah, I know you are sponsoring it now as well. So yeah, it's huge. good. Yeah, it's a big thing. i even seen a few Irish things floating around. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's good to see. Well. Yeah, it's good to see. It's looking good. <laughs> Mate, obviously, four internationals. There's four internationals between now and the end of the year. Yeah. Automatic qualification is gone, but there's still a chance of a playoff. Are you guys like hoping for the playoff or are you kind of just working on finishing out the group strong and flourishing? Of course, we, we were hoping for a playoff, you know, we're all desperate for it, but we need to set things right, you know, in the last four games, we know what we have to do, we know have to put in big performances and show people what we really are and how good we really can be, and that's that's really the main objective then. Yeah, and obviously, like, the FAI came out and said there's not going to be any managerial changes or anything like that. Has that helped set you in the 
in the changing room or is it kind of just like still having the fury of everything like the uncertainty or whatever no no i think it's certain for i think we're all happy with who, he, who the gaffer is you know what i mean we're all we're all bought into his ways and we'll all work and work and play for him so i don't think it changes much for us no and obviously we're sitting here in london your new home you left dublin for london bro <laughs> how's life out here yeah, good. It's a good life out here, man. Yeah, it's different. Just constant things to do, you know. A nice place to be. Just, yeah, it's different. I'll tell you that. It's good. It's not, it's not bad, because you're only 22, right? Yeah, 22 now, yeah. 22. You've broken the Irish transfer record twice. Yeah. How does that make you feel? I don't know. I don't really think about it. Oh, Jen, no, no, Jen, no, no, don't no. be humble, bro. Don't be humble. Tell me. No, Jen, How does it feel? I just want to play football, man. I've, t I've said this before. I don't really care, to be honest with you. Um, no, I just want to play football. I want to... It doesn't matter, I just want to enjoy it, you know, enjoy the game while I can. Alright, and speaking of the game, yeah. let's go back to the actual game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, UFC, what players are you looking forward to use it most? Uh, I think Haaland's going to be dangerous. I think it's going to be very dangerous. Yeah, I think so. I think he's going to have everything. I think Mbappe's going to have everything. Yeah, it's going to be some players that are just, yeah, just break the game, you know, just too hard to play against. Are you looking to sign yourself in the game at any point? I don't think I will. I don't think I'm good enough. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure my little brother will show me right wing or something like that, but <laughs> no, that's it. So if you were to play any other position, other than centre back, yeah. what position would you be in? I'd like midfield. A midfield? Yeah, hold the midfield, just sit there, you know. Oh, you're, you're, gonna, you're good with your feet. Yeah, you're just take him, ping some passes, you know what I mean? Get on and move the ball. Yeah, I'd like to be good fun that. Oh jeez. Alright, now let's get into this. Back to the EAFC. Yeah. Brand new in, this, in the game this year is the play styles, which are designed to make players feel more authentic. You've been given the anticipate play style, which means you're a player who prides himself in positioning and not needing to go to ground to tackle. Yeah. Do you think that's a fair assessment? I think so. Yeah, I think it is fair. Yeah, I don't like tackling. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Your centre back don't like no, tackling? No, I don't. <laughs> so, the players are too good nowadays if you're tackling. Yeah. You know what I mean? They skip by you or they go run by you. They're too good at dribbling, too good with the ball. If you tackle, they're just going to go by you. Uh, I only tackle if it's 100% or if it's last ditch. Uh, other than that, I just try position and try to outthink them, really. It is. And like, obviously, I know you play a lot of EA Sports FC, or you will be playing a lot this year. <laughs> what are you more of? Are you more of an ultimate team guy or career mode? More ultimate team. Yeah, Jeez. ultimate team, yeah. Career mode. I like being the gaffer in career mode, you know. I mean, the gaffer. Yeah, <laughs> trolling people, you know, it's nice. Get them running free season, you know. <laughs> uh, no, but uh, either that, ultimate team, or uh, maybe a bit of pro clubs with the boys. Like. I was literally about to say yeah. pro clubs. You're doing pro clubs yeah, as well. Yeah, uh, you can get heated that as well. That's a da dangerous place to be sometimes, that. that but uh, no, nah, a bit of pro clubs with the boys is always good. What position are you in pro clubs? Striker. Striker yes. 10, you know. Seriously? Yeah, take on the half turn or shots, of fr shots from outside the box, anything. You know, I'm never ending that. Defender, no, oh. not a defender in pro clubs. Never. Oh jeez. Right, so are you gonna be playing with Brentford this year, or who's your go-to team to use when it comes to EA Sports FC? No, I don't think I. I don't think I'm sick of them after training with them, so I couldn't, <laughs> couldn't be bothered playing with them. Go-to team um, has to be probably City, don't it? City again. Oh, that's yeah. over power. That's I like know, that's cheating. Why, do you blame me? <laughs> uh, City, yeah, I think City. Even Real Madrid are gonna be good, aren't they? Mm. No, I mean, so nah, them uh, City are gonna be the best, I think. So is there anyone you played with from the change room from the team that's just way too good at the game? Like you could tell after training every day, all they do is go home and just whack on the PlayStation. I haven't seen yet. No, no, not yet. I haven't seen yet. I'd put them to the test though. I'm gonna, ha I'll have them on. Like you know what I mean? Uh, no, but I haven't seen it yet. And what about the Irish team? Who plays it? Good. Um, there's someone who plays it. I think a few boys do be playing it in the rooms. Like they get a bit competitive, uh, but I can't think of the names now. I don't know, but there is a, there's a little competition going on uh, and stuff like that. It's good crack, to be fair. Speak about the Irish team, we're coming back off a double header. Yeah. France and Netherlands. That is not an easy no. test to take. No. What was your assessment of that? As much as it's tough and it's hard, like, it's, I enjoyed it. You know what I mean? You play against the best in the world, you know, you're playing against in front of thousands. It's unreal, like, it's what you want to do as a kid growing up. You want to play football against the best, and yeah, I enjoyed it as much as I hated it at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> and lastly, obviously, you've moved around over the last three summers. How does it take, like, how long does it take you to adapt and, like, settle in? Like, does that play a factor in how you play? Not really, no. Uh, it's, it's simple enough for me. Once I get a spot, my family are close. My, my brother lives in London here, so it was easy. My family are always over. It's handy enough, like it, uh, it doesn't bother me. As I said, I just, 
with football, football, it's, 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 it, that's its own thing, you know, away from football is a different story, but no, it doesn't bother me at all. You're here, and obviously you're still the new boy of Renford. What was the initiation service like? What song did they have you singing? Got away with it this year. Oh. Yeah, I was nervous for it. That's the, ner that's the most nerve-wrecking part, honestly. I don't mind meeting the lads, meeting everyone, you know. I was just singing. I couldn't do it. I hate it. Can't stand it, you know what I mean? So, no, I didn't have I got away with it this year. Look, Seriously, look, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Like, you've moved the last three yeah. summers. So, that's three initiations. Yeah, a couple of times, yeah. And it's, it's not a good watch either. Like. <laughs> but if you were to sing an initiation song, what would you be singing? That's something simple, like I think uh, I think, I think I've done Fields of Aff and Roy actually for oh, our, for the Irish team. Oh, yeah, I think I, yeah, I think just get the boys behind me, oh, like get a, get a bit of background music, you know, boys singing as well. Uh, no, that, uh, I don't know. I don't want to make the decision again. You know what yeah. I mean? My next question was going to make you sing the song. No, 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 <laughs> I'm walking out. When I'm walking out. Obviously, lastly, Evan Ferguson. Yeah. You and him are the two big names that are coming out of Irish football right now. He's the bigger name, don't worry. Oh, no, 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 he's a level, he's a level. Don't do that to yourself, he's a level. Tell me, how much of an inspiration is he to like everyone in the change room when you're playing internationally? And like, just like seeing how youthful and like excited he is to come in, like, how does that affect everyone else? No, it's obviously good to see him, you know, he's flying at his club, like, and to bring a player in like that gives a lot of, a lot of better, it brings a standard up in training, you know, we have belief going into the games, we can get a goal out and nothing like, so, no, it's good to have, he's a good lad, he get, I get on well with him, you know, and he's good to talk to, so he's a good person to be around. Oh, happy day. Yeah. Thank you so much, Nathan. Yeah. Appreciate us. Enjoy the rest of your day. We're here with EA Sports FC 24. Peace out.